Oh, well, hello, Pickpickers and Sheep Punchers. This is Jury Duty Summons, and welcome back to Jury's Junkyard. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, what are we doing today? So, well, uh, you can see my base over there, and what am I doing way the hell over here? Well, what I want to do today is build a mob spawner. And to make that effective, I need to be away from... Um, well, I really need to be away from other things a bit, to some degree. So I don't want the I don't want my animal uh, stockpile over there to interfere with it, and um, you know I, I don't necessarily want it to be right next to my base. I want it to be away from that over there as well. So it's just there's less mobs uh, spawn in any given time, and it's gonna be it's gonna be high up in the air too. So that's also gonna separate it some. So I built a little bridge here to get over here safely, uh, or just easier, just away from the the desert and everything like that. And so let's go over here. Uh, this is probably a decent spot to start it. It makes my base pretty far away. And so um, this is going to be a classic drop spawner. And then uh, later on I'll add some elements, the, you know, some lighting elements and some collection elements and a few other things that are unique to uh, the mods that we're using here. Uh, first what we're going to do to start with is just a little pad. So we're going to have a 4x4 four four column, but at the bottom of this column what I really need is we need a landing spot and um, this will just make life easier this won't be permanent once we finally uh, once once the once everything's together this will be uh, removed so but for now that's gonna be just there as a landing pad okay so let's um, how do I want to do this I think I will do what I think I'll do is do these in the corners And then um, we'll do cobblestone in between. I think that'll be a decent design for what we're trying to do here. We kind of do need this side open for now, though, so that's fine. And uh, I'm not going to make you guys watch this all, <laughs> but this is just, just to get this started here. Let's see. I don't think that's decent. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. And uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna t I'm gonna make this tower high. I want to get to like Z level 200 or so. Um, they don't need that far of a drop necessarily, but that'll help prevent uh, anything underground from messing with us. Um, but you know I'm missing something. I need some ladders. <laughs> um, one really neat thing with this with the mod packs is that we don't need wood to make ladders anymore. I just messed that up, didn't I? Ta -da. That's not nearly enough, is it? So, we're going to do some bulk laddering here. Alright, well that is hopefully enough. <laughs> I can always make more if we need it. Um, these stone ladders are, um, they're different in that they pop off real easy, which can kind of be annoying, but it's also, you know, it works pretty well. So there we go. Let's get to it. All right, look where we are. Jeez. <laughs> Quite the view. So I've gotten above, I've gotten above cloud height, which is kind of what I was aiming for, for the, um, for the first part of this here. And you can see way down there is the base. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to take the quick route down. And that's why I have the water. Because <laughs> I have otherwise there's no way to get uh, down safely. So yeah, makes life easy, right? And so um, yeah, I'm going to build this up, these other two sides here. Um, this is just going to be kind of like a almost decorative it's not the mobs aren't going to actually be falling down this side here oh that was kind of so that was not well planned yeah but all right and then while doing these corners is I'll just uh, we'll pillar up We'll, we'll noob pillar up here like this. <laughs> okay, well, we're making some progress. 
Doing good. This is looking good. Ooh, boy. Crap. <laughs> um, yeah, it's dark. Uh, about half done here. Running out of cobble, but I have plenty more back at the base. So, uh, let's go grab some. Alright, we're done. I uh, almost didn't have enough materials to finish this off. <laughs> uh, I had to go grab some more, a little bit more wood. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. We're all finished. I'm happy for that. I'm happy for that. Okay, so let's build a little platform here. Since our ladder is going to be coming up this wood, because that's just the one that's facing the base that's on the right, I will leave a gap there. Um, but otherwise, I'm going to put a little platform all the way around. I'll make this um, a two wide platform. That way, we can still have a like a, like a, a railing or something. I don't know. I don't want this to be super dangerous. I mean, it is already, but yeah, I'm gonna fall off this at some point, and it's gonna be ridiculous. <laughs> uh, uh, you know, I said I don't. Yeah, let's go with two. I mean, that's fine. I think I am gonna automate the collection at some point, but I need to build. Uh, some build craft stuff. I think there's a there's a collecting block and there's a few other things like that. Um, some tubes and stuff like that. I just don't have that infrastructure yet. Uh, but we're working on it. Let's leave that open for now. That's where the ladder is going to come up. Um, let's make this side one more. Just so I have a little bit more room. Because this is where we're going to be standing for collections, I think. That way I can put like a chest up here or something. Okay, we're good there. So we need to still go. Since this is just going to be the, since this is just going to be the collection basin, uh, we're still going to need um, a bit more structure here. We're going to go up high enough so the mobs can drop and then die. I, mean, I guess they can drop all the way down, but we don't. We can't really be that far away. We need to be a little closer. Um, so we're just going to build up these walls. I believe we want to build them up twenty. Four, I think is the minimum so let's go 26 so here's a quick way to measure how high you're going oh. and since we need we need double that so that's uh, 52 I don't know what's math ta-da 52 yep so this will bring us up exactly 26 so that'll be the base for our uh, structure, for at least the, the, the bottom of the mob spawner. Well, this is going to be awkward. I probably should have built another water thing closer up. Oh, man. Well, in any event, at least we have that as a basis right there. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I can't. I need like boots of featherfall or something. I haven't done any enchanting yet, so I don't have an enchanting room yet. So we're just got to do this every time, I guess. <laughs> and um, now that we're way up there, I'm gonna skip the wood on the outside, I think, uh, and you know, maybe do something else. All right, we're here. We're at the top. Uh, I think now is a decent time to just get started with at least uh, some of the basic structure here. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm going to have to do some creative work here to make this work. Alright, so um, we need to go out eight on these. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So what these are going to be, these are going to be water channels on each one of these. And then next to these water channels, we're going to have spawning pads. So I'll show you how that works once we get all of this finished here. Okay, so here's the concept design I have so far. We're going to have these 3 by 8 pads, each flanked by a 2 wide uh, river, as it were. Um, and then what these are going to do is they're going to be flows that's going to push them down into these channels here and then drop them down the center. And then they'll fall to their death, of course. And so um, I think I'm going to stick with 
with uh, four pads on each side. I know it's more traditional to have three by three pads, but I think this will work just fine. Um, the one downside is that there's there are directions they can randomly wander that don't lead to a water, and they can jump back up, but um, I think that'll be okay. I think it'll still work okay, uh, and I don't need like a ridiculously efficient one. Uh, I just need one that's going to generate a fair amount. Um, so I think we're okay with that. And I can always expand it or even just redesign it when I, you know, if I get to the point where I want to do that. Um, there we go. Yeah, I think, I, I think this will work. I think this will work okay. I just have to uh, give it a try, finish it up, cap it off, give it a try, and just see if it works, see if it works acceptably. Um, so yeah, they, they can, um, once they're in the water stream, they can wander back, hop back up on top to top of a pad. But that won't happen every time. That'll happen occasionally, but it won't happen every time. Uh, and once they get down to here, then it's just, they get pushed to their death. <laughs> and if they do hop off this side, they'll get, you know, there's no escape. Um, so yeah, I'm going to continue this up. Part of the reason why I want to do it this way is it's, just, it's simpler. Um, I don't have to worry about kind of worry about crazy mechanics. I know there are things you can do with cats, which I don't have any right now, or villagers, which I'm I'm not 100% sure how you move them around and get them to do what you want them to do. <laughs> um, but, um, yeah, I'll, I'll probably be messing with that at some point, but uh, I just don't know a lot about those aspects yet. All right, so I'm going to put that there for now. I need to go down and get water at some point, but this will just be a good way to keep me from falling in the hole. Alright, so I'm going to finish this off here. Uh, I don't want to do this. I'm running out of this. I know not. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. It's all good, guys. It's all good. Alright, we got walls up. Let's see what else. Um, yeah, so I'm going to be using slabs to create a roof here. They're super easy and uh, from what I remember they don't spawn zombies on them so uh, or they don't, they don't, mobs won't spawn on them when they're half slaps as far as I know uh, yeah, I could be totally wrong I mean, I, I, that's happened a few times this whole spawner might be totally uh, spawner, mob tower might be totally wrong there we go uh, I hope I have enough uh, I'm, out of, I'm running out of I ran out of smooth stone so um I have like a little bit. I might have a little bit more in the base, but uh, we'll see. I can always cook up some more if I need it, of course. Uh, yep. Ran out. So, um, I'm going to make a few more. I have a, a little bit more right now. I built this little access right here because uh, through the middle part, it's just going to be difficult. And I do plan on adding some improvements, perhaps adding some. Uh, some switchable lights so I can turn this thing on and off if I need to. Uh, that, that'll be later though. I mean, uh, it's not right now. So I built a little path right here, and there we go. I have this right here for handiness. Oh. Did I, I don't even. Did, there we go. Uh, gosh, that might be enough. Yeah. We'll see. Lol. Nope. Not quite enough. Just freaking barely not enough. <laughs> um, backup plan? Do I have one? I don't have a backup plan. So I, I guess I'm going to have to go cook some more. So I'll be back. <laughs> um, okay. So we finished off the roof. And um, I... This is actually made a decision. I'm going to do things a little differently than I intended. I'm going to use conveyor belts. Uh, conveyor belts are super useful. Um, I didn't realize they were in there until I was doing some research. And this is how they're made. Just a really simple recipe. You get a ton of them for what, from how much it costs. So I went overboard. <laughs> um, unfortunately, when I came back, there was, um, well, the place was full of gosh dang spot, uh, mobs, which I guess is kind of the point, right? Um, so I suppose things are working the way they should. 
Do I have one of these? I do have some of those. Sweet. Let's load up. Boom! Okay. So right now I have this uh, this thing finally lit up properly so I don't have spawning on me. <laughs> I can't, oh man, the whole thing was full. I had creepers going off and I finally repaired all the damage. <laughs> oh, that's what I get. Just was running out of time, so I just had to call it for the day. So I'm coming back later. Anywho, we have uh, some conveyor belts here. The reason why I, I want to go conveyor belts is that they're... You can actually spawn mobs on them. Mobs will spawn on these. Oops, i got to go aim this way. And they work really well. Watch. I get on top of it. Oh, pushed over. You know? Like it's they push so fast you can't even I can't even walk into them. So watch this. Whee! Okay, glitching out. It also means that I can expand this whole thing by a lot, and I can redo these so they're two down, two levels down, which will prevent uh, creep, you know, mobs from jumping out. So I'm gonna do that. That's gonna take a while though. So uh, you guys don't need to see that. <laughs> All right, all finished. Let's um, get the conveyors down. So I'll just do, I won't be doing that. <laughs> okay, so um, let me think about this a bit more. Okay, let's do these side ones first, and they need to come in from, <laughs> uh, that's probably not the most efficient way to do it. Yeah, seems to work pretty good. That's right. Cool, 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 cool. I'm digging this. This is working just fine. <laughs> that 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 appeals to my uh, sense of laziness. Drop it down and then put it down. <laughs> well, it ain't that spiffy looking. So it's going to drag things to the middle there. Which I've got rid of the water, but the um, the drop is still there, so that'll take care of them. Wow, look at that. Ain't that a blast. Um, okay, so let's knock these down. I'll put a couple of ladders up because you can't. it's rather hard to jump across. Oh, there. What the heck? Kind of allows you to go into the block to some degree. That's weird. Oh, I need shit. I need to get out of there. So I need the dock. I, okay. So, um, yeah. Okay. Here's what I'm gonna do. Get rid of these. Oh boy. Um. Huh. Can I really not get out of this? Ha! 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 Oh, wow. Oh, that was oh, very smart. Okay. Oh, boy. That's... That's special. Okay. That was interesting. I don't know exactly... Um, I said I don't really need to do much of like anything about that necessarily, but anyway. The reason I did that is so those torches, the the ones that I knocked down, will fall into the place if they go to the right spot, I suppose. Um, yep. So we'll put a, a ladder there. See if we can jump across. Perfect. And then take care of the ladder. go and jump uh, oh. oh I need to be over there <laughs> I went the wrong way oh, well I had to come this way anyway oh, come on no okay come on whoa whoa whoa, whoa, whoa.
Rifies. These are a real pain to try to deal with. <laughs> We need to get out of here before the creepers eat me. Um, the good news is we can take the quick road out. <laughs> Yeah, that's just good for now, and we're gonna need to back up there to close up that that door. Otherwise, something will find its way out and will attack me when I least expect it, like a creeper. <laughs> oh. I heard something in there. So we got something spawned. Alright, so that's good. Um, just to confirm what I'm going to do here is check the light levels. There's not seven. There we go. So you can see the hashes down there at the um, all down there. So that means that is a spawnable surface. So once I'm out of range of the area that's being blocked, we should be good to go. I guess it's okay to have a torch down here, but yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I, my original intention was to have a door right there, and then I realized uh, zombies would just go ahead and hammer that down just on principle. So, oh well. Here we go. We're good. Completely unnecessary, but yeah. Is that a... What in the world was that? That must have been a... a uh, oh boy. There's something over here, and I don't know what it is, but uh, we'll deal with it. Oh, crud. Um, good point. Oh my god, that thing that scared the death out crap out of me. Fucking googly eyes, really? Oh, that's a problem solved. Ha! Huh, cool, we're getting uh, creeps. Um, maybe more? <laughs> we're, we, there we go. Didn't drop anything though. Uh, cool! It works! Ooh. Um, wow. Okay. Not as fast as it could be, but it's actually fairly good. I could just be standing here with them if I wanted to. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, yeah that's, that's great. That's good. I think the next thing I need to do, and I'll probably do this in a later episode, because this one's probably getting long enough as it is. I'm happy to this? Uh, as it is, it's getting long enough. So what I'm going to do for now is um, let's make sure nothing spawns in here. I think that's probably fine. Yeah, that'll prevent mobs from spawning right here. Uh, anyway, so I'll just leave this in as it is for now. Um, I'll probably do some hoppers or something similar. Or I might even do something like... No, oh my God, no. This is not, not, not okay. Give me a freaking... You terrible, terrible chicken. Yeah, 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 see ya. <laughs> um, huh, okay. So maybe I need to add something here to take care of those. Spikes, maybe? Um, but can you do will spikes destroy mobs? I don't know. Hmm. I certainly can't just leave uh, that to happen. Or maybe I can do... Oh, there we go. That's not a terrible idea, right? Yeah, maybe it is.
There we go. Um, that might actually kind of work. No. No, of course not. Needs to go this way. There we go. Uh, and th there we have it. That's actually a, a decent solution. <laughs> and then I can just um, put that there. Oh, we killed a spider. And, and from there, I can actually just even keep an eye on it. And that should keep most mobs from coming out. Let's see. Will that... Uh, Oh, I can't do anything. Okay. I want to put a slab right there, but that's not going to happen. What can I do here? Um, that might work. <laughs> I'm going to stand right here and should, should be able to <coughs> Oh my goodness. Sorry about that. I should edit that out, but I won't. <laughs> well, anyway, have a great day, guys. Um, if you have any suggestions or comments or questions, let me know. Haha! <laughs> it works! Now I can go AFK for the rest of the night and just fill my inventory full of stuff. <laughs>